Welcome to PC Mac. In today's video, I'm going to use Casa OS to install Nextcloud Pi on Raspberry Pi. So let's do it. Now let's just go ahead and open Safari and open Casa OS screen. My Casa OS is on 16. 992.168.1.16 and here is the operating system log on screen so I'm logged in and from here we need to go into app store and here is the next cloud so let's just go ahead and install it and installation started it will install all the required packages Now you can see we have the next cloud image right here. So let's just go ahead and click on it to configure. It's saying uh, it's not able to connect. Let's just refresh the page. And it's done. Let's try now. Okay, it's not opening up. What we can do here, let's move to the settings from here. And see the port number that it's using is 42023 and uh, it's binding it to the container 80. So instead of 80, we'll use the 90 and let's have it on 443 and save the information. Once the information saved on the Casa OS, then we'll try to relaunch it again. Now the information is saved. Let's just try one more time. Okay, it says 16 and uh, let's try to use the port 90. And let's refresh the image by clicking on this icon and let's try open it again. It's not working somehow. Okay, and the Casa OS is working. Okay, it's working everything is good to go let's try to check the settings one more time so bridge connection next cloud latest let's try with port 80 one more time so it's working now now what we need to do we need to create a username and a password but before that you can see it says performance warning you choose SQLite as database. SQLite should only be used for minimal and development instance. For production, we recommend a different database backend. So we are not using it for the production. We are just using it for the practical purpose. So we'll use the SQLite. Otherwise, we'll use MySQL or other database, Postgre SQL. Now let's just use this one. In my next video, I'll use MySQL or MariaDB to install the next cloud. So I'm creating a username and a password and install it. Save the password. Now the next cloud is installed. We'll use the recommendation recommended apps option as well. So it will install these apps calendar contacts mail next cloud office and talk let's wait for some more time once this is done i'll get back to you now the applications are already installed and you can see the next cloud screen in front of us and it says next cloud hub let's click on the side and you can see all the options are installed and it's ready to use we can customize our next cloud widgets from here if you want to configure the mails recent activity and everything will be here in the form of cards on the bottom 
now we have on the screen uh, for next cloud you can set location or weather it will detect the location if you select that option let's check or we can just enter the location from here we can set the status as well in a meeting or anything so this is the easiest way to install next cloud on raspberry pi with the help of casa os if you face any problem you can write me down in the comment section i'll try to answer your questions and that's it for today if you like my work please hit the like button subscribe to my channel press the bell notification for my latest videos share this video with your family and friends thank you for watching bye bye take care have a nice day